Grand Rapids is a thriving and energetic city that has a lot to offer its residents. Our city has created something to do for people from all different walks of life. Take a trip back in time to the dedication of Calder's Le Grand Vitesse. In 1969, Alexander Calder's Le Grand Vitesse was installed in front of City Hall in downtown Grand Rapids in an area now called Calder Plaza. The Calder, as the piece is called among locals, inspired a three-day arts festival to be held each year in June. Originally sponsored by the Arts Council of Greater Grand Rapids, the first festival was held in 1970. With only two stages and a few booths, no streets had to be closed for the first few festivals. Over the years, festival's popularity grew, eventually encompassing most of downtown Grand Rapids. Today, festival is the largest all-volunteer arts event in the nation. Festival celebrates its 45th year this year with six performance stages featuring the best of Western Michigan talent from everything from hardcore metal to modern rock and roll. Dozens of food booths are operated by area nonprofits serving a variety of foods, including ethnic specialties, desserts, and even kids' foods. Endless art and activities for all ages can be enjoyed as well as a variety of street performers. For information about the festival and volunteer opportunities, visit their website for more details. Well, that's all I have for you from this city we call home. This is Jared Grismer from the Grand Rapids Information Network, signing off.